Melvin, can you help me out for a second? Can you get these pallets on, like, out of the way? We'll clean this out so that we can actually show the pieces and they're not blocked. We're going to be talking about the biggest piece that we have in the warehouse, which is also uh, the most expensive piece that we have in the warehouse. And uh, it's a question I get asked a lot, what's my biggest, most expensive piece? And it's this guy right here. So one of the reasons why this is such a, it's not just because of the size that it's uh, lucrative or that it's the most expensive, it's because citrine is cooked amethyst and the ovens that they use to cook citrine in have become uh, much more efficient and smaller. So they can't cook pieces this big anymore. Actually, uh, the biggest pieces that they're cooking now are about four foot tall. So if you have big pieces of citrine, basically that, there's no more of them being produced. So that's one of the things that makes it so lucrative. It's also giant and the quality of it is spectacular. It's got these cubic calcites and we keep it covered with plastic so no dust gets inside. I'm not even looking to sell it quite honestly. Someone would have to give me literally like a, a quarter of a million dollars for this in order for me to sell it. So we usually get um, a variety of different things, a lot of spheres and a lot of um, towers, um, small and large for our company and a lot of smoky quartz. We like the fact that everybody's very friendly and very easy to get along with and the pricing is transparent um, and he just has really good deals. So we have a bunch of new stuff in. Uh, one of the items is these Labradorite towers. There's also a bunch of other towers that we got in. We got the Black Moonstone, uh, K2, Obsidian, Calcite, Petalite. Got a bunch of different flames in stock. Uh, Garnierite, which is a really tough, tough stone to get right now. Black Moonstone, Quartz, Rose Quartz, Polychrome Jasper, Carnelian. Also restocking all our free forms, including Garnierite, which again, like I said, is really tough to get. Okay, we also just restocked on a bunch of spheres. Got Labradorite spheres, Carnelian, Flower Agate, Moonstone, Hematoids, Ocean Jasper, Garnierite. Also got in a bunch of Pink Amethyst, some really cool stuff. This is Joe, and this is Craig from the Blue Lotus. Uh, they're one of my first clients. Remember the first warehouse? Yeah, I remember. We were just talking about it on the way here. Yeah, the little tiny bathroom garage. That's right. Yeah, when we had the little tiny garage. And you guys are... Your father was on the other side. Yeah, good guys. Very good guys. Come here every we couple just come weeks. We come couple weeks stock. to fill up and things are selling. A lot See of what's new and exciting. right now. Um, we think with the uh, COVID, it seems to be uh, people have been buying a lot of smaller, quick feel, pick-me-up items. Chris has always had a good selection of that kind of stuff. Why, why, why do you guys shop from the mine? We it's got, the customer service. Yeah. Actually, Chris is a great guy. He's yeah. always very knowledgeable. His uh, materials are always on point. His prices are fair. It's great. We've never had a lease in We've never had an issue here. with Chris. <laughs> or the staff, actually. Yeah. 70 and 70? Okay, good. Thank you, Rod. You okay, will. and now we got this stuff on the carts? Okay. These are nice. This is really nice. Sometimes you get clients that come in here and they, ha they have a very specific budget and they don't really understand how pricing works so they fill up their carts with like thousands of dollars worth of stuff and then they get the check out and you're like, okay, your total is $5,000. like, oh shit, I only have $1,000. And then you're in a real, we just, we just bit, pretty much just went through that right now. And we, Second time in a row. Yeah, and it's brutal. Especially when you're busy, like you can see right now, we have like clients all over the place and video calls going on. So someone just wasted like an hour and a half of our time because they don't know what they're doing. It's not like their fault and it's like nothing you can do about it because it happens, but at the same time it's like, it's like the worst. It's really the worst. And then you get clients like that, like Joe, like Michelle, like Thea, uh, who, who have been with me from the beginning when I had nothing, like it stuck with me all this way through. It means a lot to me and I'll always take care of these clients like as hard as I possibly can. And I, I really do love them. Pretty much me and Rod over the last month, month and a half, have been just not literally working through the day, not eating anything, and just literally doing this all day. And it's like, people don't know how hard we work. Especially, especially Rod, he works all day. He don't even eat, he don't even go to the bathroom. People don't know.
Where'd that come from? That's me, baby. So that was, that was on the table? No, no, <laughs> that's me. This is, we got, we got Labrador. Better not be on the table. Mm -hmm. Well. Then we got Golden Dude, this Hero. thing is so dirty. I know, it's dirty as shit. <laughs> Old and dirty. Just like you, baby. <laughs> this is my baby. One of them. I love Kyanite. And I have a couple other pieces that I, uh, that I bring around me sometimes too, but this is like, like my best friend stone. <laughs> so we have decided for the holidays to sell all of our excess private reserve, meaning all of the higher end pieces that we collect throughout the year. And son of a gun. Hello? Hey, how are you? Good, I I'm just in the middle of like, I'll call you back in three minutes. Okay, clear it back. So this is a sample of some of the stuff that we're gonna be putting up. So you see here's some spheres that we're gonna be selling. Uh, some tourmalines and some optical calcites. So yeah, follow the page and look forward to us posting all of our private reserve there for sale. Busy, busy, busy. Busy like a beaver. Right now what's about to happen is uh, there's a customer who made an order that was too large for UPS and too small to be palleted. So right now, to accommodate the size of their order and getting shipped properly and safely, I'm gonna be cutting this pallet in half, uh, more or less, to meet the, the, the size of their order. These customers are particularly amazing too. Great people. So now we just gotta finish wrapping up the order. Get it wrapped up and sent out. Business as usual, you know? This is the holidays, so get it. a lot of corporate companies contact us to get um, corporate gifts together. So like you see right behind you, uh, all these amethyst geodes. We had 20 of these amethyst geodes. Plus Danny's trying to find uh, 20 quartz clusters that are about this big and another 20 quartz clusters that are about that big. And those are corporate gifts. So we're getting a lot of that happening. Uh, that's kind of tough to do but a very lucrative packing orders that I got to ship out. Danny's wrapping, you know, there's clients in the house, in-house shopping right now. We have online orders coming in. Max is packing corporate business, uh, corporate orders. Melvin's packing corporate orders, and I'm kind of just, you know, orchestrating is what I do. And Rodney just got off a video phone call, so it's, it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on.